Hey guys, what's up? Is your friendly neighborhood Ubus here back again with another Slay the Spire video? What's the uh, what's the daily for today? Silent with diverse time dilation and hoarder. Eh. I'm gonna actually give some attempts to ascension. Um let's do Let's do Ironclad. I'm feeling some Ironclad. I like this character a lot. I think he's sweet. And I like making terrible decks with him that can do 8 million damage in a single turn. Uh, choose a rare card to obtain has got to be really good, so I'm going to give it a shot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, now we have, like, some really tough choices. This is actually, I think this might be the most difficult possible choice. And the reason that I'm saying that is, Barricade is incredible. Like, if you get a block deck, good job. But you need Barricade for the block deck. So getting it right away, despite not being able to necessarily use it for a while, um, just cements us in the block deck. And the most important cards in the block deck are both common, Shrug It Off and uh, Body Slam. So it's not too terribly difficult to get the rest of the cards for the block deck. Um, Double Tap is, of course, the other incredibly powerful card here. And... I could definitely see this one uh, if you're going for an offensive deck. And then Immolate is shockingly close, mostly because having an Immolate right away should basically just guarantee that every one of the Act 1 fights is just free, right? Like, 21 to all enemies. I don't know if you guys know this. That's a lot. <laughs> 21 is a big number. It's more than 20. Um, so it's actually a really hard choice. But I haven't done a block run in a while, so I think I'm going to go for Barricade. Uh, you probably disagree with that choice. I honestly don't think there is a choice that I could have gone for where everybody would have ag agreed upon it. Because uh, I do think it was actually just that hard. But that's okay. Uh, I'm going to start here. We're going to aim for a relatively early shop. Not too early, but relatively early. This actually works out decently well. Um, we have a pretty good shot of triple strike. We did not get triple strike. That's okay. Because now we have a guaranteed double strike. At least. I mean, <laughs> we're good. Uh, cool. Oh yeah, the uh, the reduced potion slot was in, in the place of the reduced potion effectiveness. Which I'm very thankful for, to be honest. Because I always was like, I'm going to fire potion to deal 20. Why didn't it deal 20? I don't understand. What's wrong? Is this a bug? <laughs> it's like you put me in that fucking super hot meme with the, you know... Is this blank or whatever? Uh, and for me, it would be, is this a bug? Right. Hitting this guy. He's dead to double strike. Unfortunately, it didn't quite work out the way I was hoping. Um, now, I could block here. I think that's actually totally fine to do so. Now, I'm only missing effectively one health. Uh, but this dude is Mondo dead. Mondo. Blood potion is... It's fine. I'm not super stoked about it. I think I will actually take Iron Wave. I think it's early enough that Iron Wave can be pretty good here. Um, I actually... <sighs> I want to remove a strike. I'm going to remove a strike. Alright, I thought... I, I've convinced my own brain that removing a strike is the correct play. Took me a minute, but I got there. Alright, uh, yeah. The other idea, by the way, was to potentially just upgrade Barricade, but the thing is, we can upgrade pretty much whenever removing cards is a, a much more, like, specific sort of thing. Um, there's no way to kill you this turn, so we'll just get you to 9, take 1. We're doing pretty okay on the health. And we just need 8 damage, so we should be good. I don't know why I went for the slowest animation I could, but I did it. Flame Barrier is actually incredible. I'm going to take this card. Um, I think it's tremendously underrated, especially by myself. Uh, okay, so what are we doing here? Let's remove a card. I'm tempted by True Grit, but I think removing a strike is going to be ideal here. I think as far as block is concerned, we're doing okay on the block. I will upgrade Barricade. Make that play. Um, now I could go up to the right and fully dodge Elites, or I could go for the just actually worse route. So we're going to dodge Elites entirely. And I think I'm going to be pretty okay with that. Um, I would just like to block this fully. I want to get out of this with as much health as possible. Um, yeah, I will run this out. I, think, I mean, I can take one just fine, so I'll do it this way. Would have liked to play Barricade there, but he was attacking for more than I felt comfortable taking. Here, I'm just going to go with a Bash. We're doing alright. 
This man is, is, he is persistent. Thirteen, huh? Right. Take another one. Yeah, we can take another one. That puts us to 70 post-fight, which isn't that bad. Alright. Well, no barricades yet. Uh, there's Shrug It Off. Snag that as soon as I can. And pretty much at this point, we got we got it all, right? Like, all we're missing is our boy Body Slam. Oh yeah, I forgot this enemy frails, huh? Okay, well, uh, well, we can take one. It's probably our best bet. Doesn't feel great. It's gonna frail again. That's okay. I'm gonna run out of Flame Barrier. The question is, do I actually need to make progress on him? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> Gotta hit him at some point. Alright, uh, I think this is a pretty simple turn. The question is, do I care more about the slimes or the the three block? I think the three block is actually going to be better for me. Yeah, yeah, immediately I, I think I've been paid off. Okay, so do I want to bash you? Or just, I think, hmm. Yeah, let's bash him. I think bashing is going to be good. He's attacking again on this turn, which I don't like. And only block 12. Take six. It's still not that bad. That's nine. Nine puts him to not splitting yet. So what if I actually take a little bit more damage? And then we have him set up to split here, and we just get one free turn. Well, not the greatest free turn in the world, but I'll take it, I guess. Uh, I feel pretty... Ugh, this is pretty rough now, actually. I think I do just want to prep as much block on the turn before I become frail. So let's do that. Okay, neither is attacking. Let's shrug. Uh, I'm gonna... I guess just we're gonna focus this one, and then we'll get a little bit more block as well. Losing out on one damage to gain three block, I think, is definitely worth it. I'm just gonna prep this guy as much as I possibly can. I think we're alright. We're getting there. <laughs> we have too many slimes, but, you know, we're getting there. Okay. Start with this. Great. This is actually totally fine. Um, so now we have four slimes total in the deck, which actually isn't even that bad. And we're doing it. It's slow, <laughs> but we are doing it. Alright, I'm just gonna run it like this. I can kill him a little bit faster, but this is definitively safer, you know? Just guaranteeing nothing, nothing wacky happens. I really wish I could just drink this now. I don't understand why I can't. Um, you could just ditch it, probably. I don't know, is skill potion actually good? Uh, do I want these? Any of these? Honestly, burning pact is, like, totally fine. And it can enable, um, what's the card even called? <laughs> the dumb exhaust card. Yeah, I'll try burning pact. Do I actually want a skill? No, let's, let's go without that. Or calcum. Not great, I'll admit. Uh, doubt. I'm gonna skip on that one. Let's give an upgrade to something. We could do this to draw more cards. We could do this. This is probably one of the best. It adds, um, it's not the most amount of block, right, to be added, but, like, it's pretty decent. Alright, we're taking one. Fine with that. Staying pretty healthy overall on this one. Uh, I don't like this situation at all, but I think we're just gonna go full defense, taking six. I think now I'm pretty happy to just pop this, and I will just pop it right now. Like, right, right now. Um, the question is, what else do I want to do for the turn? I think I do actually want to shrug. Just build up a ton of block, man. That's, that's all I want. Alright, let's prep that dude. Hope this guy's powering up this turn. He is, that's wonderful. Get a lot of block. 21. Yeah, that's about what I expected. Yeah, we can just bash him. Because it won't be 21 this turn. Yeah, now it's 14. Uh, that's not enough damage, so we'll just do this. And we have enough block anyway, so whatever. Sweet! That went well. I will take Ghostly Armor. Ghostly Armor is a ton of block for just one energy and one card. It's definitely a big deal whenever you can get it out there. I could have played it there, um, you know, I was just talking it up, <laughs> but I, I do believe that this ends up being slightly better. I don't know. Hard to say. Like, this races a little bit better than the other thing. Um, eh, 
What could I hit? I could hit Flame Barrier. All right, let's actually just ditch Bash. Did not hit Flame Barrier, but we can block enough. And we're guaranteed Flame Barrier next turn, which is great. Except for this part. <laughs> All right, we're going to go full offense on this turn because he's webbing us. Sucks a little bit. Would have liked to build up the block. All right, we're good, actually. Never mind. So now he's at 16, which isn't too bad. Easy peasy. We're doing it. Uh, I do want another flame barrier. I think a third would be way overkill. I think the second might be overkill, to be fair, but... Hmm. Let's do it this way. Prioritize the taking zero for the turn. I don't know why I just played Iron Wave instead of Strike. <laughs> I got something, something wrong in the brain. I will get rid of one basic defend. I think we can live with that. Uh, yeah, we'll just do this. And unfortunately taking one, but we do have Burning Blood for that, so it's not too bad. I actually don't need to play any block this turn, but I'm, I think I'm going to. Yep, good. Um, so Oracalcum, uh, occasionally, occasionally, quite rare, but uh, it can occasionally do some good for us. We're good now, though. This is, like, just a complete freebie. Alright, I'm gonna go Flame Barrier and uh, an Iron Wave. Or I guess he loses the block before... Th Never mind, I shouldn't have Iron Waved. Whatever. <laughs> Let's get more of this shit. Uh, do I prefer one damage or more block? More block, motherfucker! Okay, get rid of a Defend. This out there... I guess in this case it's correct to Iron Wave. Okay. <laughs> this is a weird one. This is a weird situation. I think I am going to Burning Pact away the strike. I'm just going to make the deck real thin. Really thin. Although, to be fair, 28's a big fucking number. <laughs> so I think I do actually need to make some progress in the, in the direction of murder. That's enough block, so I guess we're just running out all the block. Get him to six plus five block. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> all right. And now he's five six block. All right, we're good. <laughs> A little dangerous, but I didn't actually take any damage, so seems like we did fine. Uh, I'm gonna skip on these completely. We're definitely gonna upgrade, obviously. And the question is, which thing do I want to upgrade? I think it'll be the other Flame Bearer. Just have them be consistently good. It's a beautiful start. Absolutely gorgeous. It's possible I could have started with the Burning Pact, just to get something out of the way, but... I don't like that damage, though. I would like it all. <laughs> it's only seven, admittedly, but uh, I don't like it, so if he could not, that'd be swell. Heh, <laughs> fuck. Alright, just do it pretty slowly. Let's get all the block we can. Yeah, this is about right. <laughs> so Burning Pact will draw into basically garbage, so I'm gonna get rid of a basic defend and then recycle those. So, I mean, we can probably just exhaust all of our basic defends and still be pretty much good to go. I'm gonna start with exhausting strike here, though. No, let's... Yeah, let's hit another basic defend. All right. All right, it's block time. Because <laughs> there's no reason to attack when I can't actually break through. I hate this. He's just never attacking on the turn I want him to, dude. Not one time. There we go. Oh, thank God. All right, it took, took us long enough. Boom, 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 boom. Look at that. Woo! <laughs> that's the secret, dude. That's the way. That's the way you do it. That's how this fucking fight works, bud. That's <laughs> all you gotta do. All you gotta do is block a lot forever. Right? Block a lot forever, get it to huge amounts, and then on exactly the one turn where he attacks a lot, like a lot of instances, draw it again. Yes! <laughs> then you set that up, and then you fuck him up. Look at this. Look at this! Woof! Beautiful, dude. That's a fucking beaut. We're making progress. The number's going up. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I 
All right. Uh, yeah, there's no reason to play Iron Wave over Defend, so. Nice. Um, yeah, let's get rid of another basic Defend. Flame Barrier. I wanted to wait to see what I drew, obviously. Pretty important to make sure that I don't lose out on Ghostly Armor. I want to do this, but maybe... I mean... Nah, let's just keep going. Just, just keep going, man. He's not making progress. We're actually building. Alright, how many more basic defense? That's the last one, and then I have two strikes. Alright, let's get rid of the strike then. I'm a mad lad. So now our deck is nine cards. I mean, I could set it up to just be, like, a very specific, you know, set of cards. To pretty much be good to go. To just flame barrier every turn or something. <laughs> I could totally do that. Alright. That'll phase you. So I'm just gonna do it. Uh, and I guess I am in a shrug. Yeah, lost burning pack. That's obviously not what I wanted. It's totally fucking fine though. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. Sit back and relax, boys. This is gonna be a long one. Alright, I am actually... I'm, yeah, I'm actually gonna exhaust one of these flame barriers. And that seems insane. I know that seems insane. Look at this progress. Um, but I'm gonna try and get a specifically five card deck. I think my five card deck... I guess Burning Pact has to be one of them. But I want Flame Barrier, Ghostly Armor, Iron Wave, Burning Pact, Shrug, I think. That sounds good. Let's get rid of this strike. There's the Flame Barrier. It's possible that I just ditch Ghostly Armor, though. Like, maybe I just let Ghostly Armor fucking fall away. Seems like we're good on this turn, though. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna Burning Pact away, Bash. Just get it out. Then I'm going to shrug first before Ghostly Armor. So I redraw Burning Pact, and then I'm going to Ghostly Armor. So I have a six card deck. I guess we basically have the whole thing, actually, now that I think about it. I pretty much always have the whole deck. In fact, let's just ditch Ghostly Armor. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> so is, it, is this literally what I'm going to do for the whole... The rest of the fight is I'm gonna flame barrier and iron. <laughs> I think that's what I'm doing. <laughs> I think that might be exactly what I'm just doing. Look at this progress, dude! Look at him! Look at him die! <laughs> He's getting fucked. <laughs> this is incredible. This is this is what I honestly this is this is what I come here for. Right? Like, this is... This is what I live for. We're already, like... If this were a different run, by the way, if this were a different fucking run, we'd be halfway through the run. More than halfway through the run. Run would be fucking over, dude. Alright, on this last one, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna let him kill himself. Easy. <laughs> Oh, uh, that actually was really fun. <laughs> Is that weird? Um, well, I don't need feed. At this point, Immolate seems questionable at best. And Berserk sucks, so... Fuck all that shit. Uh, could Astrolabe. Is that a good idea? Probably not. Let's just go Philostone. I really do need the energy. Obviously, the bonus strength that the enemies get is spooky as fuck. So, let's just hope that, uh, I don't die to it. <laughs> it's pretty much the only thing I can do is hope. Um, where are we going? Ooh, I see a sweet one. Every route has to fight at least one elite. But boy howdy, is this a sweet one. I think. I think this is a sweet one. I don't fucking actually know, dude. Um, I could bash to try and just, like, get through that shit, but I don't think that's gonna really do much. <clears throat> yeah, just full block. Like, I don't know, this this is probably gonna suck, because the frail is brutal. We'll eventually make progress. It'll take a bit, though. Mostly comes down to these kind of turns. Also, did I? I totally didn't play enough cards on the previous turn. My bad. Alright. 
So this will hit. Yeah, this is actually perfect. This is this is ideal. Because now I'm a genius and I can actually do math. <laughs> All right. Keep it going. Frail's gone. I don't think he refrails though, right? Pretty sure once he's done frailing, he's done. Um, yeah, let's just get a little bit more block for a little longer. I'm not seeing him refrail, so I think I think my assumption is correct. We'll get there. Don't worry. Eventually, eventually his health will actually go down. You are currently witness to his health somewhat going down. Not quickly, but <laughs> down is the direction it's going. I'm probably never ever gonna play Bash, so fuck that. Don't worry, he is dying. <laughs> There he goes. Probably should have struck at this point. Get rid of this. Get this and that. <laughs> this is the dumbest fucking thing. Alright, we can just strike now. Probably should have played that one first. Hey, it worked out. Look at this! We're doing it! <laughs> Honestly, I should have. I don't know why I didn't just play a second flame barrier. I don't need ghost, ghostly armor anymore. Yeah, I'm just gonna strike. Fuck ghostly armor. I guess I'll just play this block. I don't know, he's dead. We did it! I didn't lose a single health. Easy game. <laughs> I'm gonna take true grit and I'm gonna try and upgrade it at this point. Ooh, yeah. Give me 90, 90, and then leave. That sounds good. That should be okay. That should be sufficient. Alright, so let's start with this on this. Yeah. Got flame Barrier and Shrug. Let's start with Shrug now. Alright, so now I'm going to actually bash to get the Vuln up. Barricade time. Question is, do I actually need to keep Ghostly Armor? Probably. And I think I will also play the defend. I should have popped the power potion. That was a mistake. Alright, and now I'll try and refrain from playing blocks unless it's like super fucking necessary. Or it's ghostly armor. Which to be fair is like mildly necessary, I guess. You wanna put it that way? Right, let's start with a shrug. Yikes. Fucking big ol' yikes. Yeah, there's some big yikes. I could have played that block to, you know, take less. I don't think it was actually going to make a big difference, though. I will play a Flame Barrier and a Defend here, because my next turn, I have a pretty easy one. You fucking, what the fuck is that? 48? Well, I guess I'm taking one, but 48? 48's too much. That's not fair. I'm going to die. This is a brutal fight. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm actually, like, completely fucking dead. Like, the problem is I have to play blocks, or I die. And if I play blocks, well, I die. So... <laughs> yeah, whatever, I misordered it. It doesn't matter, I'm dead. Oh my god, what the fuck is wrong with this stupid fucking enemy? God damn it, I hate that enemy. I actually never like that enemy. I, at no point am I like, that's a good enemy design. Why is he allowed to hit for fucking 50? He's in Act 2 regular mob. He even There's a regular fight in Act 2, or it's it's deemed a hard fight, but it shows up in regular combat rooms, where it's him plus one of the birdmen. And I'm like, what the fuck is that? Anyway, whatever, man. We're giving it another shot. Hey, look at that. It's a great start to the exact same build. <laughs> I just need a barricade and we'll be good. I really fucking hate that enemy. I don't know, I don't know why he's allowed to do what he fucking does. Now, to be fair, right, in in the defense of... Yeah, whatever. In the defense of him being balanced, it is worth noting that I had Philosopher's Stone and was vulnerable. But simultaneously, can that guy fucking go away? Forever, please? And thanks in advance. <laughs> if you, uh, you know, if, if that makes it to the people <laughs> then it needs to. If he could just fucking leave. <laughs> right, we're gonna... We're gonna take one, intentionally. 
Keep that Voln up a bunch. Um, yeah, that is very incredibly lethal. Ooh, Corruption. Clash? I'm gonna take Corruption. We're gonna give this a shot. So, Corruption, you can make it work outside of the Dead Branch Corruption runs. Um, hopefully I'm gonna show that off, at least somewhat here. I don't know, it probably won't go very well considering I'm already out of blocks and I'm just gonna take fucking seven on the chin, I guess. He should be dead this turn though, so I guess it's fine. Mm, ooh. Yeah, Rampage, because our deck is gonna be thin as fuck. Yeah, give me the 20 damage, that's fine. Probably shouldn't have gone to the shop actually. Now I regret it. I will take a Clash. Uh, I could rest. I don't need to. I would overdo it. Overdo it. Let's upgrade Rampage. This is a weird hybrid deck. Fuck. This is a weird hybrid hybrid deck. But I think it should actually be pretty good in the end. We'll see. But I, I do think that this has some real fucking potential. Um, I have no block this turn. Which really fucking blows. But I guess I'm just going to go for max damage. And take 8 Okay. That's the power of Clash, obviously. Uh, I could take Shrug it off. Works with Corruption, I'll do it. Smiling Mask is decent. Okay. So I want to run this out, and then 8 plus 21. It's not lethal on either. So in that case, I am going to aim for the Looter. So double strike will kill, but it's pretty unlikely. I guess I also have Rampage, potentially. Oh yeah, but then the weaken. Of course. So that's nine. It goes to eight first. Yeah, no. I mean, this is probably my best bet, though. I don't like it. Uh, okay, where are we? Well, let's do this to you. Let's get the block required and then do that to you. Taking a bit more damage than I would have hoped, but I think we're going to get out of this just fine. Flex is good. Uh, Reaper is pretty good, too. I'm going to take Reaper first, because Flex is more common. I really don't want curses, so I'm going to deal with this and probably die. Oh, boy. <laughs> They're starting off strong. I'm just going to full defend, because this is the turn where they're just all attacking. It's pretty rare that they all attack, like multiple turns in a row especially, so I'm going to do it like this, and we're going to hit this guy, because I want him dead ASAP. Unfortunately, I am taking a bunch and losing some plated armor, but I think that's okay. Yep, this is pretty much the worst case scenario, but we're going to be just fine, except for the part where now we're vulnerable against two buffed enemies. Which I don't appreciate, but we can totally kill one, so let's kill the higher health one. And then just shrug for the block. And it's actually gonna end up being okay. Sick. Odd Mushroom is nice as well, and now I will take a flex pretty happily. Uh, remove a card or smash to gain gold. Ooh, that's a tough call because we have this shop right up here. But removing a card for no actual money cost seems good, so I'm going to do that. Um, and I'm going to hit a strike, just thin the deck. We got a bonus shop, okay. Um, Rage is a weird one. It's It has anti-synergy with corruption. I'm just going to remove another strike. Just get the deck thinner. Um, and removing the... Damn it. Removing blocks is not super relevant. So this would exactly full heal, but I don't think we actually need it against Slime Boss. I'm just going to upgrade Flex. And hopefully this goes well. No promises. <laughs> but we'll see. I think I am actually going to pop this on this fight. We got Rupture. Doesn't really do anything, unfortunately. But get to do this. Get a lot of healing out of the deal. Got to deal a decent amount of damage. It's not too bad. Um, I hate everything. So, you know. Hey, what turn are you going to draw the one single curse in the deck that gets exhausted as soon as you fucking use it? 
How about on the turn where I draw my fucking clash? How's that? I should have owned. Uh, whatever. I do want to kill this guy first because of the weaken. Because this this makes this a Voln reduces the damage taken, but this is spooky scary. Um, sick. Sick. Sick nasty. Yeah, I mean, you just go offense. Like, there's really no reason to play slimes except for this situation, but we're good. Rampage did scale decent. Um, um, I'm gonna skip on these. Mark of Pain would be great, <laughs> but it ain't. So I'm gonna take Eternal Feather. Really just don't want things clogging up my deck, which obviously this sucks if I'm going for a thin deck, but the other two options just added shit to my deck and there's no downside to this, so. I'm fine with it. Uh, There's no good route. No, they're all trash. There's only one route to fight one single elite, so I'm gonna take that one and pray. Oh, hey. Uber Goose, what's it like always drawing the one singular card that actually prevents you from uh, from using Clash um, every time you draw Clash? What's that like? Well, it's not great, motherfucker. Hmm. I guess I'll just do it this way. Mm-hmm. This is probably just par for the course. I would I I guess I just expect this at this point. Right. Oh yeah, flex exhaust. Yeah, maybe I should just ditch corruption. Maybe maybe corruption's real fucking bad for this one. That's losing out on like a lot of shit actually. Damn. There is actually no good play. <laughs> That's our best play. <laughs> just take 20. 20 in the process. All right, well, at least I got the heal 6 back, so I'll take that, I guess. Fruit juice is nice as well. Um, I will take a heavy blade over in flame number two. I guess I'll pop this. Let's start with a shrug, in flame, defend, and we get to clash. All right, that ended up being beast, and I still take some damage, which sucks, but there's no way I'm never taking damage. All right, play this one first, and then do I want to... No, I want to rampage real bad, so let's rampage. Fuck corruption. Shouldn't have taken it. Corruption's killing me. I can either kill the dude or heal for 12. So kill the dude is definitely the optimal strategy. Because he's hitting for a bit more than 12. Hmm. Well, now there's an extra card that makes Clash unplayable. <laughs> I guess I'm going to do it, though. See what happens. It's pretty unlikely that we kill him this turn. I think almost impossible, in fact. Well, 24. So this is 27 plus 9. Yeah, we're just short. So in that case, I'll just do it like this for some healing. Feels a little bit bad. Man, this second run has sucked. <laughs> uh, I don't think I want any of that shit. I guess with Corruption, it's not that bad. Look. This deck is trash, alright? Please understand. Okay. Alright. Ha! Fuck! <laughs> alright. Great. Whatever. I, I guess I was actually, like, pretty okay with that. You know what? Fuck it, dude. Let's hard commit. I don't know what we're hard committing to, to be completely honest with you, but we're doing it. At this point, I will upgrade the Corruption just so we have more energy to hurl stuff around. Lantern's good. Uh, beautiful start. A beautiful start. I'm going to focus the Chosen. Because this bird don't matter to me at all. Boop, 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 boop. Maybe the bird should matter a little bit. I don't know. Right, so with the shrug, I guess. I don't like this situation though. We already have enough blocks, so there's no reason to play more defense. Except that they would get out of the deck sooner. Problem is that I'm gonna draw five fucking dazes. Like, 
yeah, no, I'm drawing five bases next turn. It's already, you know, it's already been foretold. Well, it's not five. So I'll live with it. <laughs> One short. <laughs> One short of five. I'll live with it. Damage is obviously not so good. Really? That's fucking 24, huh? <laughs> I mean, I'm killing him, right? There's there's no way I'm not killing him there. Ow. Um... <laughs> like six down to eight. Seems okay, you know? No big deal. I landed him. I did it. Maybe I should have given a shit about the bird sooner than I did. <laughs> maybe maybe it's possible that what I did was incorrect. Alright, give me a headbutt. I guess we do get to basically full heal every time we get to a campfire, so that's cool. Probably not that guy. It's probably one of the two strength cards. I'll go with Heavy Blade first. Okay. Start with this. We're already blocking enough. So, what I'm going to do is, yeah, we're going to focus the slaver. So, we're going to do this, we're going to do this, we're going to do that, getting this back, and then basically just praying that we don't draw too much garbage, but, well, we did. Unless we, corruption! Fucking shit-ass bitch. Alright, whatever. <laughs> do what I gotta do. Cry myself to sleep. Alright, well, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this. You know what? I probably played this really poorly. Alright, in this case, actually... You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. Gonna blomp, gonna blomp, gonna blomp. Gotta blomp! Look, I'm losing my mind, dude. This run sucks. This run was, like, almost good. And then it just... It just immediately wasn't. <laughs> and last run was great! And then I faced the one fucking enemy in the game that just ruined my life. This is gonna be hard to break through, huh? <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe we're fucking good to go, boys. Uh-oh. <laughs> well. Um, that's actually exact lethal unless my brain is fucked. I'm a god. Spot weakness is pretty decent. I'll take it. And then we'll upgrade in flame, I think. Fuck me, dude. Oh, fuck. Alright, dude. <laughs> well, immediately this is not good. I guess I do have to vuln. I'm already taking zero. Okay, let's apparition. Let's do this. Bite. Take zero. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. What am I putting on top, dude? I don't know. What's in my drop pile? Oh, it's only apparitions. Alright, so it's probably just rampage then. Am I dead? No, not quite. <laughs> Pretty close, but uh, not quite dead. And now we get a little bit of a reprieve. Not much. We still take four this turn. And we got four fucking wounds. How's this turn? Well, well yeah, that's... Yep. It's a turn. Alright, well... We're not actually dead. <laughs> but... Oh, thank god. Alright, we're, we're actually... We're good. I fucking should have bit. I'm stupid. Duvu doll. Okay. Skip on these. Remove a card. Yeah. Get, get one of these fucking garbage piles out of here. This one. Look, I'm not trying to say... Like, I don't think this run has any possible chance of winning. But, it's not the worst run ever. Now it is. <laughs> I'm actually getting hit on turn one on the champ. How do, how do I recover? I don't. At least I get to take zero for a few turns. God. Um, we're already blocking enough, so uh, there's really no reason to play the shrug. We may as well just get all the damage in that we can. Okay. Uh, 
Seems like a decent enough turn to run out the corruption. Now, there's going to be one very distinct issue with this fight. Uh, and that's I'm out of these now. <laughs> I'm out of the things that make me not die. So, uh, whatever. Fucking exhaust it. Let's go, dude. Let's go full aggro. Aggro! Okay. 20. This is a big number. I'm only taking 16, so it only halved me. <laughs> Fuck! Uh, do I just run this out anyway? I think so. And let's get this out of here as well. So he's debuffed us, which sucks, and then this turn he's powering up, and then he's gonna hit us for all of our life. Which I'm not, like, super stoked about, but I think uh, I'll live with it. Not like I'll live, right? Like, if he executes on the first turn, like this turn right now, yeah, I'm dead. I tried, though. And at the end of the day, that's what really counts, right? That's the best I got. You know what? I'm fine with it. I'm cool with it. That deck sucked. <laughs> I don't even want to see that deck anymore. It's trash. Uh, well, thanks for watching. <laughs> that, that sucked a lot, obviously. Um, really, this run was... This run would have won if it was actually any other enemy in this room, I think. Like, I, I honestly think that it was basically the perfect moment to fucking kill me. And very obviously the perfect enemy. And then this run, I don't fucking know what happened. I mean, it made it farther than the first run, I guess. So it may have been technically better, but probably not. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all the good shit, and I'll see you guys back in the next episode. Should be on Tuesday if it's Slay the Spire. If you want to watch Angel of the Gungeon, that's, uh, that's out tomorrow. So... Peep that shit, fam.